Tim. What's up? I'm not in the screen. So we're back. Yes. Um, we've been posting videos about once a week mm -hmm. because they they do better when they're spread out more right now. Yeah. Because we don't have a big fan base. So if we spread it out, it gets a little more views than if we do them days in a row. Yeah. Why am I going to turn off? Well, well, don't worry. We'll get you a permanent one in a few months. <laughs> Anyways, um, today we're doing the Would You Rather game. Game, yeah. Game challenge. Whatever you want to call it. Um, Doing it on my phone? Yeah. Now, some people have seen Markiplier do it, and he does it on his computer, and he records the screen and everything, but we don't have that stuff yet. So, right now, we're just doing it on our phone, so we'll read out loud everything, tell you what we picked, and tell you the percentages of what right, so everyone like, in the world picked. Am I asking you would you rather, and then you tell me which one you'd want, and then I'll tell you the percentage? Doing that, or are we doing uh -huh. it on our own? Well, we'll read it out loud, and then like you can pick the first one, and then I'll pick the second one. Okay. And then we'll just go for like maybe a few rounds and see how it goes. This is just gonna be a quick video. Yeah. To see what you guys think. Um, if you like it, I have an idea of another video you guys liked a lot, which was the lie detector. So if you guys like this, we're gonna combine them both. Definitely. Which I haven't seen anyone do yet, so that would be a unique idea for our channel. Alright, so we're gonna get started. Yep. Would you rather? Would you rather? Okay, you want to yeah. answer first or my answer? Uh, you can answer first, just gonna right. Would you choose to watch paint dry for a living, <laughs> pound chalkboard erasers for a living? What would you choose? Personally, I'd choose paint dry. I would choose chalk, actually, because yeah. at least you can make a little beat and entertain Good yourself. Chalk. Oh, 59% of the people said chalk. 41% said watching paint dry. My turn. Would you choose to have your hair perfect every day, but wear sweats all the time? Or wear nice clothes every day with your hair in a ponytail all the time? Well, personally, <laughs> I don't think ponytails look good on me. <laughs> so, I mean, I wear sweats pretty much all the time. So, I'm going to go with the sweatpants one. Oh, wow. Again, I'm in the minority. 42% <laughs> chose with me. Okay. Would you choose to ask a woman what underwear she wears? <laughs> <laughs> We're doing this in random, I hope you know. Yeah. Or ask a plumber why his butt crack is so beautiful. <laughs> okay, see, this you have to look at as like a gender perspective, really. Alright, I'm gonna go with... Like, I feel like if I was a girl, the woman one wouldn't be more That's what I'm, I'm gonna choose because it doesn't say who the woman is. It could be my best friend. That's it's true. a woman. Alright, yeah. And girls talk about that kind of stuff. 64%. She has been in the majority every time. Okay. Would you choose to go to prison for the rest of your life? That's dumb. Or have no clothes for the rest of your life? Uh, <laughs> you know what? You know, I, I kind of want to be free with my body. <laughs> I'm going to choose no clothes. 61%. Would you choose to dance to Gangnam Style or do the oh, Harlem Shake? Oh, oh, Gangnam Style. All right, definitely Harlem Shake because those are the best kind of videos. <laughs> I love Harlem Shake videos. Oh, wow. 74% said Harlem Shake. Nice. Because you can just do so much random spontaneous stuff with it. And pelvic thrusting. Would you choose to be able to remember all of your dreams forever or... Be able to watch your dream on TV the next day. Oh, that is cool. I want to watch my dream on TV the next day. 63%. What would you have said? Watch it on TV. That would be cool. Alright, would, would you choose to speak Spanish fluently or speak Italian fluently? 
See, I feel like I have more battalion in my family, so I feel like that would benefit me more. Yeah, but the Spanish is like the second largest language in the world or something. Uh, but Not I, I know, but, in the world, but like... But I mean, like, if I'm going to take the time to learn a language... It doesn't say you have to learn it. It's just you can speak it fluently. I, I'm going to go Italian. Wow, that is close. That is. 52% said Italian, 48% said Spanish. Oh. Would you choose to eat one hundred a lot of ants <laughs> or mate with a butterfly? That's a lot of ants. That's like maybe five ant hills combined. That that is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven zeros after the one. Is that a hundred million? Let's see. So this is hundred thousands billion. It's a hundred billion. A hundred billion ants are mate with a butterfly. I'm wrong, that's like 20 anthills. How would I mate with a butterfly? I'm, I'm gonna go with the ants. <laughs> oh, oh man. my. 81% said they would mate with a butterfly. Only 19 people chose the ants. 19%. I guess no one wants to, I think it's the concept of having to eat a bug. Yeah, but they're small, so would you really notice? I just think it's because mentally you know you're eating a bug. It well, just mentally I know I'm doing it with a butterfly too. <laughs> apparently, <laughs> apparently people have an easier time with that. Your turn. Would you choose to eat a large spoonful of salt or a mouthful of ground cinnamon? See, I think my mom would back me if I did either one of these. Well, don't. See, I I've done the cinnamon challenge. I've seen people do it. Tiffany did it. It it's not fun. It's dangerous. It is dangerous. You could die. But salt, man, you'd be saltier than the ocean. <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm gonna say. S oh, see, I don't know. I don't like just salt by itself. So that would. I don't, ew, I'm just like, when the See, even though this is it? just a game, it like makes you think. I'm gonna say a mouthful of ground cinnamon. Ooh. But salt, just a mouthful of salt. I can handle that more than cinnamon. <laughs> oh. Oh, I'm. I'm in the mind. 56% said the salt, 44% said the cinnamon. That. Would you choose to get caught checking a girl out by her or her boyfriend? Well, <laughs> um, I don't like this question. <laughs> it makes me weird because my girlfriend's sitting right here. All right, let's do this this way. If the girl was you, I had a boyfriend. And I wasn't your boyfriend, even though I told you I would kiss you if you had a boyfriend. That's besides the fact. <laughs> besides that. <laughs> um. Hey. And I think I'd rather be caught by the girl because, like, I'm a guy and I know how guys get. Yeah. But a girl, like, I mean, you can say, like, I didn't know you had a boyfriend or something. And, yeah, so sixty-five percent agreed with me. Okay, would you choose to watch Transformer Transformers or watch James Bond? See, I watch. They're both good, but I know which one I would pick. You pick Transformers. Uh huh. I say watch James Bond. Oh. Fifty-fifty, guys. Fifty-fifty. Which means there was forty-nine. If you, if you count it as 1%, we don't know like what the percentage is for. Mm. But it's 50-50 right now, so... 
Right. Would you choose to have dinner with a giraffe wearing a suit and tie and eat beans and rice in a sombrero? Or do the salsa with a pirate wearing an afro and tights? This is... Why do I get the really weird ones? <laughs> so are you freaky or are you freaking? I'm going to dance with a pirate. 53 said the giraffe. I mean, how often do you get to dance with a, or eat dinner with a giraffe? Well, if you're Kevin James, you can do it whenever you feel like it. Because he owns the suit. So does Matt Damon. He does. <laughs> fell, school, fell at school or fell at sports? <laughs> I'm going to say fell at sports. 75% said fell at sports. No one wants to fell at school. Oh. No, because you need, you need to pass school nowadays to get a good Anything. job. Alright. Would you choose to <laughs> swallow a fish ho hook or put it through your eye? <laughs> Alright, guys. I go fishing. So I know how bad they hurt just pricking your finger. Now do you want to ingest one? Oh, you have to think about that. If you ingest it. It's got to come out. Uh. I'm swallowing it. I'm going to swallow it. Okay, so. 76% said swallow it. It's just something about the eyes. All right, we'll do like two more each. Okay, okay. Would you choose to have a laugh that goes chuckle, chuckle, chuckle? Or have a laugh that goes tee hee 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 hee. Well, I mean, <laughs> I'm gonna go tee hee 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 hee. I can make you go tee hee hee hee. <laughs> a lot of people agree with me. Sixty-three percent. Okay. Would you choose to marry someone you don't know and don't love, <laughs> or marry your boyfriend's dad? <laughs> well, guys, I don't have a boyfriend. <laughs> Would you wanna marry my dad? Can we? Can we? Can we, like, because I feel like this is for a girl. <laughs> you want to so just get a new one? That would, no, that would mean marry my girlfriend's mom. Right? I guess if, so. we're, if we're going to do this to gender specific, but let's not do it because it's just what you rather. But I, you know what? Yeah, let me marry my boyfriend's dad. God <laughs> damn it. <laughs> I was in the minority. All right, last one for you. All right. Okay, would you choose to fight two horse-sized ducks, or fight 15 duck-sized horses? <laughs> Could you imagine all those little horses chasing after you? <laughs> now, this brings up a story from the past I don't think I've ever told you. Oh, God. Um, I'm going to say fight 15 duck-sized horses. I feel like it'd be cute. Do you want to know my story? A lot of people agree with me, too. Alright, well, there's a duck pond in the park we took a walk at a few times, in the Creek Park. And, well, when I was little, my parents took me there, we went to feed ducks, and I had a piece of bread in my hand. And all the ducks came up to me, and I screamed and cried and took off running, and they all chased me because I still had the bread in my hand. <laughs> yeah, you told me about that. Uh, I did. Okay, last one for you, Dad. Last one. Would you choose to have a giant hamster... Or a tiny rhino. I want a giant hamster. I could ride that thing into battle. What? <laughs> Only 16% of people agreed 18. with me. Oh, 18. I can't read. You want to do a bonus one? Bonus one? Mm -hmm. Alright, that we both pick? Yeah. Okay. Would, Would you she? rather have fingernails as hair or have uh, hair, hair as fingernails? <laughs> <laughs> Harris fingernails. Yeah. Yeah. Seventy-two percent. All right, guys, that was quick. Would you rather um, tell us what you thought? Um, it was just an idea we got, and something quick we could get out there. Um, next week is really busy for us. So. Yeah, Thanksgiving, his birthday. Let's see. 
We got Thanksgiving dinner at her house on Tuesday. And I work Monday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. And then my birthday Saturday. We might do a video Saturday. I can see that happening. Uh, I know she's probably going to want to do a video. Just to remember my birthday. I don't need help remembering your birthday. No, I mean like what we do or whatever. Oh, yeah. Um, and then... It's December and December eighth, eleven months. It's been it's been it's been a journey, guys. It has. I mean, you guys have been with us through most of it. Since March thirteenth. Yeah. Definitely on March thirteenth, expect a flashback video. Definitely. I'll get working on that like in February, so it's ready. But yeah, um. We have some projects coming up. Not really, just gaming stuff. We're gonna try to get going. Definitely Minecraft. We both like it. Yes. And maybe we'll record a video tomorrow. Maybe. But it won't go up tomorrow because I want to space them out a little bit more because that's how we get more views right now. But when like we get more subscribers. Um, we'll get more up frequently. Yeah. So, we're gonna leave you guys here. Deuces. Deuces.